as you went into the pandemic, uh, there's sort of a couple phases as you went into the pandemic and you sort of tailored your response, I think, as a leader to those different circumstances. Obviously, in the first 60 days of the pandemic and early in the spring of 2020, you're sort of in absolute crisis mode and sort of responding. And some of the things you have to do as any leader is be incredibly communicative. Mm -hmm. uh, and, very, and you have to instill a, a flexible attitude. Uh, we were very fortunate at the RMR group. Uh, we went into the pandemic with very low debt. In fact, at the RMR group itself, we have no debt. We went into the pandemic with a lot of cash on our balance sheet. We were able, for those employees that were not able to work from home, and we had a large number of them, they continue to have to go into the buildings and make sure that they were operating well. We were able to up their pay, give them hazard pay, for example. Uh, we were able to give full bonuses as we got into 2020. Uh, and I think we sort of, through what we were doing throughout the pandemic, sort of indicated to people and many touch points that, look, we're in the commercial real estate industry. We manage a lot of office buildings. We're going to have to take a leadership role here in trying to demonstrate the ability to get back into the office. Uh, and you sort of made that bet you, when you came into the commercial, in, commercial real estate industry that you're going to be sort, probably at a company that's going to do that. And so we had our employees back in as soon as the state mandates were lifted at whatever minimum occupancies we had, we were hitting them. We have been fully back since Labor Day. Of course, we were a little nervous that we were going to have a lot, some attrition or some pushback. We've had almost no pushback at all. And I think that's largely a testament to the, you know, the great people who work at RMR, but the fact that I think we were sort of indicating all along, hey, as soon as we can get everybody back in the office, we're going to do it because it's, it's been, we have to lead. If we can't do it, how can we talk to our tenants about getting back right. into the office?